Welcome to Trains Are Fun. We're going to be looking at one of my favorite Thomas and Friends characters and one of my favorite to collect. It's Murdoch. He's just looking for some peace and quiet. So we got this Murdoch and we're going to show you. My best friends are Harvey and Salty. We're going to show you all the different versions of Murdoch uh, that we have. And you let me know if you know of any others. We only got eight different types of Murdoch. In fact, we only got eight Murdochs total of any kind. Uh, so we're going to show you each and every one of them, and then we're going to show you the OO scale Murdoch running on our layout, because we haven't done anything on our HO scale layout in a long time. Here is our smallest Murdoch. It's the wind-up Murdoch that came in the Gashapon capsules by Tommy. Uh, these are the, the little capsules, and it runs on the little tiny uh, blue track. Um, and there's, like I said, it's just a little wind-up. Come back, Murdoch. So, so that is our little, uh, the littlest one. I like it. It's, oh, sorry. <laughs> it's, it's kind of a hard one to find. Next up is the learning curve. Take a long I think that's what you call it, take, and lo take along um, Murdoch. He's only got eight drive wheels. Um, a little disappointing there. Of course, you know, the, uh, the capsule one only had two or four, I should say. <laughs> and I, I think there might be two different versions of this, but this, this one I had came out in 2004. Uh, if you know of another version, let me know, and I'll go try to collect that. But this is a nice little uh, metal die cast Murdoch. The countryside is so beautiful and calm. So this one is, wait a minute, I forget, is it Bandai? <laughs> I can't remember. This one came out in 2010. Um, oh, I can't remember the name of it, the company that makes it. Let me know in the comments below. I'm always forgetting. Uh, it's not Ertl. I think it's Bandai or something like that. Uh, let me know in the comments below. But it's all fixed like an Ertl. It's plastic, though. It's not die-cast metal. It does have the tin wheels, though. I am strong and have ten drive wheels. And yes, you do. You got ten drive wheels. And this is the Ertl version. This is a really nice uh, die cast. I do wish the Ertl had done uh, separate tenders instead of making it all one unit. Uh, but that's what they did with all of them, so we, we can live with it. Just looks really nice, though. And this was a gift uh, from Charles. Uh, we got a video somewhere on our channel where he sent this uh, to us. But it's beautiful. It's just beautiful, shiny die cast Murdoch. One of my favorite pieces in my collection. So this is the, of course, Thomas Wooden Railway version of Murdoch, Murdoch's Tender. Uh, he's only got eight drive wheels. <laughs> but uh, this is the only wooden one that I know of. If you know of another one, let me know in the comments below. I love peace and quiet. Yes, you do. And this is the uh, Tommy version. Now, he does have all of the proper number of wheels. Uh, but the, the locomotive part is not what drives it, it's, it's tender driven, which is common on some of the uh, steamies, the bigger steamies uh, with the Tommy stuff. But uh, this is also an expensive one to find. I'm actually looking for maybe getting another one <laughs> because I, I use this one a lot and I don't want to wear it out too much. But um, again, I think this is the only one that's compatible with Tommy Trackmaster that has been made. I 
So this is our most recent acquired Murdoch, the um, six-wheeled <laughs> golden bear Murdoch. Just adorable. I love it. So that just leaves the OO scale Hornby Murdoch, which may be one of the most magnificent pieces in my collection. I don't, maybe I'm uh, over exaggerating that, but it's just a really nice model. But I always keep it in the box trying to protect it. And you don't usually ever see me, well, you never see me using this in crash videos. Um, it's very expensive to find it's, uh, today. If you go to look for it, you'll, you might not find anybody selling it, but if you do find somebody selling it, they're going to probably be asking four to $500 for this. But let's go get this and put it on the track. That's a close call. I wasn't filming, but it almost fell off the track there. Woo! What's going on with this thing? Oh, I give up. So thanks for watching my Murdoch collection video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to see other collection videos, let me know what you want to see in the comments below or what characters or whatever. Anyway, just uh, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already done so and like the video, please. And we'll see you in the next video.